right here I got my Jadam, my JLF, uh, Jadam liquid fertilizer. That one is filled with, I want to say everything. When I first started, this is my first bucket. This is uh, almost a year old. Um, I call it potassium rich, everything rich. Um, because it has everything, literally. Like a, there's a chunk of wood in there, even, which was a mistake. Um, but a bunch of tomatoes, uh, food scraps, just some of everything in there. I'll strain that off, and it's a cool way to have free fertilizer. Now, in this bucket, I started later. When I start to learn and finesse a little bit more of the system, this is just nitrogen. This is strictly leaves. Um, I'm actually going to be dumping some more leaves in. These both are about a year old. They don't smell as bad as they used to when I first started, um, but they still stink. Uh, I have a buddy who has like three plus year old JLF. Um, but yeah, we gotta just take the last of my hydroponic stuff. Some more greens to the pot. I can see the bacteria like I to grow. I might eat, even uh, add some 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 probiotics, some lactobacillus, some acidophilus, some um some gut bacteria I might be adding to these guys too, but um, when I first opened it, I stirred it, I saw that it had a nice uh, top layer, so it was, the temperature is getting nice, it started to develop its, uh, its anaerobe bacteria back, so I get like a little strainer, stick that in there, scoop some off, and then I figure out the measurements, and I just add it to my water, and that's my plant feedings, free fertilizer. You don't need, and it's all natural. I know exactly what goes into it. It's just family food scraps, um, stuff from my garden last year, stuff from the yard. Uh, got a lot of good stuff in the yard. I got my own uh, worm castings. I had layers of dirt right there from the yard that had order for growing on the sidewalk. And as we stacked them there, they started growing, not growing, but uh, producing worms. And uh, I kept them there, and I kept them nourished and fed, and they gave me some good stuff, and I bagged that up. So I'm going to be dumping that in my raised beds. I'm going to have some, um, I got some cardboard I've been saving too, when I end up ordering anything, so... This will continue to break down. This is my nitrogen rich JLF. And this I consider my everything rich, but uh, probably more potassium. And uh, since there's wood, maybe um, carbon, carbon and potassium rich. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna cover these guys up. They smell, but not as bad as last last uh, last year when I first started. And that's my cool new shovel that I bought, heavy duty joint. Loving it so far. Got to clean up this area, get it right. Got little sprouts coming on my uh, thingamajiggies. I don't know what this plant is, but it grows back every year. I've been hacking at it, and it seems to like maybe even more sprouts because I did that last year. So. Still even got some leaves I've been keeping. I'm gonna try to mulch uh, my plants with some of the leftover leaves. So that's all. Just just getting ready for the season. Gotta take it slow and just easy. Easier than usual. And uh, I'll cover this back up, let it break down. Gave it a nice little stir. And that's it.